Hi, and welcome to Rose Rocket Platform. My name is Jeff. I've been in the industry for about 20 years, working both as a broker, carrier, and even a consultant. And I'm super excited to show you what the Rose Rocket Platform has to offer. The Rose Rocket Platform is a whole different way to run your business. In this video, we're gonna cover four key concepts that the platform offers, modules, boards, records, and widgets. First, let's get started with modules. On the left-hand side, you can see a navigation bar. Our navigation bar is made up of different components called modules. These are the tools that allow you to operate in different areas of your business. For free users, you have access to the basic features that streamline your fundamental business. And for paid users, we have more modules that can help you with that. Now, let's take a look at boards. The trucking industry loves spreadsheets, and for a good reason. They're flexible, and they give you the freedom to see and do what you want. Boards in Rose Rocket are helped to design, recreate that freedom, but inside your trucking platform. So let's hop in and create a board. In this case, we're gonna create a customer track and trace board for our customer, Costco. We're gonna go ahead and create a new board. Once we dive in here, you can see that we're gonna select our board type, whether it be orders, quotes, or something else. In this case, we're gonna go ahead and call it our Costco tracing board. And from here, we're gonna decide what custom columns are gonna appear on this board. So for example, if this is a customer tracing board, we may not wanna include cost and margin on this board here. Lastly, we're gonna set up some security features. Here we're gonna add a customer security feature so that this board is not gonna show all of our customer orders, but instead just those orders for Costco as we plan to share this board with our customer. Now that we set the settings and the security filters, we're gonna go ahead and create our board. Next, we're gonna show you our intuitive records view. We can pull this up in invoices, orders, quotes, or any object at all. Let's dive in. So our first panel is called the navigation panel. This highlights different things like a map, our financials, documents associated with this order, along with all the individual stops for both pickup and delivery as relates to this order. Our second panel is our activity panel. In our activity panel, we're gonna see breadcrumb details that let us know what our users have done within the software. It's also gonna house each individual widget in our widget recipe. Lastly, we have our data panel. The data panel houses all of the internal details of the order and allows you to manually input any of the entire fields that you would need to on your order. And the last component is widgets. Widgets are your workflow assistant and they give you a list of actions that you need to complete in order to complete a particular workflow. Widgets make learning software easy, they minimize human error, and they accelerate the team's learning process. And that's it. In this video, we covered four key concepts, including modules, boards, records, and widgets. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.